I'm Guy Lane and this is the Planet Report for May 2019. Arctic sea ice extent continues a downward spiral at 11,886 square kilometres, the lowest ever recorded for this time of year. Chance of a blue ocean event this September remains steady at 12%. The northern jet loopy factor is 6.5. Antarctic stratospheric ozone concentrations are stable at 275 Dobson units. Ice loss on the White Continent continues its run with 685 million tonnes lost in the past 24 hours. That's a sextupling since 1979. Average ocean pH is 8.1378. Sea level is rising at 0.07 millimetres today per day, on target for a metre rise by mid-century. Atmospheric methane continues to pour out of the Arctic and frac sites around the world, reaching an average of 1,866 parts per billion and seriously retarding efforts to meet the 2 degree Paris target. Atmospheric CO2 at Moana Loa is 414.75 parts per million, down a little from yesterday due to the progression of the northern summer, <clears throat> but buoyed by anthropogenic emissions of 102 million tonnes a day and rising. That's way above the safe maximum of 350 mm -hmm. parts per million CO2. <clears throat> CO2 equivalent is 515 parts per million. Synthetic fertilizer production is up at 549 kilotons per day. We should see some strong ocean dead zone figures when the data comes out next week. Global average temperatures are 1.02 degrees Celsius above the 1880 to 1900 baseline, over halfway to the two degree threshold that is dangerous to humanity. And in the good news section, a Peruvian court has banned oil companies from destroying an ancient tropical rainforest that has thrived under the stewardship of the Warani people for thousands of years. And finally, Extinction Rebellion arrests have reached a new high of 2,300 a day and are rising fast. What's your name, mate? Daniel. How old are you, Daniel? 17. Why have you chosen to be arrested today, Daniel? Our planet is dying. We should be crying. Thank you very much, Daniel. I'm Guy Lane. That's the Planet Report.